this tiny bar uh, with no crew. And when I tried to tune my own guitar on stage, I, I couldn't do it anymore. <laughs> It's so embarrassing. <laughs> and it's really embarrassing. It's perfect. <laughs> it brought it right back to the beginning. That's great. A Sky Full of Stars came out about 11.30 at night, and it, took, it came out in about seven minutes. That song really ended up being inspired by EDM, which some people turn their nose up at, but then you go and see an EDM thing and people are so together and having the best time so I was like fuck it I, I love that stuff so I want us to have a song that comes from that world but in terms of I'd really like to jump up and down to this we don't really know what we're doing so let's call Vavici I showed him the song and said please could you help and he said with his backwards baseball cap yeah that'll be 12 million dollars <laughs> Just does it like a transition thing. He did a full Avicii version, and then we did a full Coldplay version, and then we spent weeks like weaving it all together. Like we'll try this with this, or this with this. Essentially playing Tetris or something took fucking hours. <laughs> That's why it took so long. I don't care. Go on and tear me apart. I love that song. And so far when we've played the sky full of stars in the few concerts we've done, there's just such a collective um, feeling of fuck it, let's just sing. that it's come out of this dark place. It's, it was the last song to be written and you know I was asking for it for a long time. So we've got all these other songs going through this journey and I, we need this like door opening to the sunrise. Your sky, your sky. It's the most important song we've ever had lyrically. Because every time I sing it, I'm like, yeah, that's how I want to live my life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, there's stuff going on in the world right now which you can't imagine why this is happening. It's crazy. I don't know what the answer is, but if you didn't have faith in the universe that somehow something great will emerge at the end, then we'd all give up, and that would be a waste of everyone's time. That would be terrible. Get your phones out, guys. 
See the hope in your heart. 